What's going on guys? This is Codex Amp back again with another video. And in today's video, I'm going to talk about Assassin's Creed. So then the first time I played uh, my first ever Assassin's Creed game, it was Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. And at that time, I think I was in grade 6, and I started playing Assassin's Creed uh, I think it was on a Saturday, and then I finished playing the game on a uh, which one? On a Thursday, I think. It took me at less than a week to finish the game, and then I think I had one of those packs where you buy one game and then you get another game free, and then the other game that was free in that package, uh, it was Assassin's Creed Revelations. And I'll tell you the truth, I couldn't even install Assassin's Creed Revelation because it just didn't even want to play or even install in my PC at the time. And I may have to say I was using a potato PC at the time, so yeah. Fast forward from 2013 up to 2018, December. I was already finished with my final year in high school, and then I started playing Assassin's Creed Revelations. And if I may say that Assassin's Creed Revelations was not the best Assassin's Creed that I've played, uh, I think Brotherhood like is one of the best Assassin's Creed in my book. And the gameplay you're watching in the background is Assassin's Creed 2. Uh, I haven't played Assassin's Creed 2, but I started playing, I think it was this year, somewhere April. So, now I'm giving it another try. And so far at the moment, the game doesn't age well, but it's still a fun game to play. Throughout the first, I think the first chapter I played it, I've enjoyed it a little bit. But then I'll just have to see as soon as the story uh, progresses. So, while I was playing Assassin's Creed 2, I've noticed something. Something that made the whole Assassin's Creed series change and I don't like that change I'm just being honest I honestly don't like that change because if I had to give you like a 10 second um, if I had to give you a 10 second breakdown of the Assassin's Creed story it's Assassins versus Templars Templars are the bad guys Assassins are the good guys and then throughout the history of time the Templars want to find the apple and the apple is some device that that can give any person godlike powers depending on who can handle the apple that's the end so then mainly you track the where the apple was from beginning to the end and then the apple was found i think in assassin's creed brotherhood but here's the thing the game didn't end in brotherhood it didn't even end in Revelations, but the sad thing is they decided to go all the way back to Origins, way back through Egyptian times, and to be honest, I think if they ended the series in Assassin's Creed 3, or yeah, if they ended it, it okay, if they ended it, the series in Assassin's Creed 3 I would have been fine with it but now they continued from there on up until I think the latest one that is upcoming next month is Valhalla and I'm not sure how Valhalla will be but at the moment I've heard good reviews about it so then at the end of the day me as a fan of the whole Assassin's Creed games up until let me just be specific up until Assassin's Creed 3 I think no I know it will be a good thing if they ended the Assassin's Creed series while it was still popular 
I know a lot of people think that the game is alright and everything, what they're doing with the story now, it's all good, but at the moment, ending a game while it's still popular makes the game even better to play. Up until, like for instance, up until like the GTA games, how many GTA games us gamers have ever had across the whole GTA series? I'll be honest with you, GTA games are not that good anymore. To me, they're not that good. That's because they never ended the GTA series up to GTA, I think it was San Andreas. They should have ended the GTA series in San Andreas and then started with a new one. But still, they keep bringing back old characters, new characters, old characters, new characters, and then it becomes a bit tiring at that point. I think the point where it started to become a little bit old was in GTA 4, when they brought back some of the characters. So, yeah, all in all, Assassin's Creed should have ended long ago. That is my opinion. Please share your own opinion when this the Assassin's Creed series should have ended. I'll reply to your comment. So then, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. And oh yeah, before you leave, just enjoy the gameplay. It's gonna be a two-part.